Jerome Allen was last seen alive between the night of Friday, October 19th and the early morning hours of October 20th, 2018. Approximately one month later, the Windsor Police Major Crime Branch entered into a missing person investigation. Through our investigation, we now believe that foul play was involved. Today marks the second anniversary of Jerome Allen's disappearance. His family has been very involved with investigators during this case and wanted to speak publicly to ask for assistance. Out of respect for their privacy and in consideration of COVID-19 safety measures, a pre-recorded message has been prepared. There will be further update after the message. We are preparing this public statement, but requesting our continued privacy afterwards. This is a difficult situation that no mother should have to go through. The disappearance and murder of our beloved son, Jerome Corey Allen, has been unbelievable and traumatic on the family. There are no words to express the pain, the hurt, and the suffering that we have been enduring for two years with no answers and not knowing exactly what happened to him. This had been a never ending nightmare that no one should have to go through. Not only do we mourn for Jerome, but our family had not had the chance to say goodbye. And his body is yet to be found. We need justice. We need everyone's help to solve this case so that those responsible for the disappearance and murder of our son, Jerome, face the consequences of their evil actions. Jerome had hopes, he had dreams, and he had a smile that can brighten up anyone day. He was only 29 years old and had so much to live for. Jerome was a loving son, brother, and father. He loved his family. He loved his children so much. Those children meant the world to him and they miss him tremendously. His son will not have a dad to play ball with and answer questions. His daughters won't have their father to walk them down the aisle on those special occasions. We won't get to see our son smiling face as he beams on those special days. Help us get answers to our many, many questions. Jerome, we love you. We miss you. Please, we're asking from the bottom of our hearts. If you have any information, no matter how small, please come forward. Search within your hearts and your conscience. <clears throat> Jerome was our son, our brother, our father. We're asking anyone out there who may know something, please come forward and contact the Windsor Police and do the right thing. As stated, Jerome Allen's family is requesting their privacy be respected moving forward. The Windsor Police Service echoes a request for further assistance and information from the public. This has remained a very active investigation for the last two years. 
Investigators would like to thank members of the public who have come forward with information thus far, but would like to ask for further assistance in providing some closure for the family in locating Jerome Allen's body and bringing this investigation to a successful conclusion. We believe that there are more people in Windsor, the GTA, and throughout the province who know what happened, who is responsible, and where Jerome Allen's body is now located. The Windsor Police Services Board has authorized an increase in the reward to $10,000 for information bringing the responsible party or parties to justice. Anyone with information is encouraged to contact the Windsor Police Major Crime Branch or anonymously through Crime Stoppers. Thank you.